It's common for manga artists to use naming conventions when creating names for their characters, like how Akira Toriyama names many of his characters in Dragon Ball after food, or how H. Oda names many of his characters in One Piece after historical and or fictional pirates. But in the case of JoJo's Bizarre Adventure, creator Hirohiko Araki really cranks up the awesome dial to 11 by naming several of his characters after musicians, bands, and even song titles. These unique name conventions give the show an extra layer of flavor, and I gotta say, it's always fun hearing my favorite musicians or bands referenced, as well as being introduced to an artist I've never heard of before through JoJo. And I'm not the only one who feels this way. If you search any music reference in JoJo on YouTube, scroll down to the comments section, you'll see hundreds, if not thousands of comments quoting, making jokes, or just having a discussion on how much they love JoJo. Because the localizers of JoJo wanted to avoid trademark slash copyright issues, Many names were altered in the US version in order to prevent any and all legal repercussions. And that's what I'll be discussing today, all the character name differences in the Japanese and English version of JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. To keep this simple, I will only cover name changes in part 1 through 4. I'm only going to be discussing drastic changes, such as the case of Santana being renamed to San Fiento, or Devo being renamed to Soul Sacrifice. Minor discrepancies due to language differences between Japanese and English, like the world and the world I'm going to ignore for the most part because a I'll have to cover every character and by the time I finish I'll be older than Dio in part 3 and B the main purpose of this video is to focus on changes made for legal reasons with that out of the way let's begin part 1 Phantom Blood being the shortest part naturally has the fewest amount of changes Tarkus, named after the Emerson Lake and Palmer album of the same name, has his name only ever so slightly changed in order to avoid legal issues. Instead of Tarkus, he is named Tarukasu. This is the romanization of the Japanese pronunciation of his name. This will be a common lawsuit evasive maneuver used by the localizers many times over, so uh, you know, get used to it. Bruford, named after Bill Bruford, the drummer of Yes, has his name changed to Blueford in the localized version. It's funny, they used the Yes song Roundabout in the Phantom Blood anime ending. you think Bruford would be the one name they would really want to keep in the US version. Or maybe they just like Blue Fords. So that's it for Phantom Blood. Uh, you might have noticed that I left out Tom Petty, Dire Straits, and Zapelli. And the reason I did that is because their names weren't altered when they came to America. All their Japanese names are the same, so I really am bummed out about this because I, well, I was hoping to talk about these characters because I really like them, but unfortunately, I can't. Next, I'll say, moving on to JoJo Part 2, Battle Tendency. Moving on to JoJo Part 2, Battle Tendency. Hmm, nani? The Pillarmen had all their names altered in America. Wham, Cars, and ACDC have the spelling of their names changed ever so slightly. Wham is spelled Wamu. Cars is spelt with a K instead of a C, and my favorite of the Pillarman name changes is ACDC, which is yet again the romanization of the Japanese spelling of ACDC, which becomes ACDC. The most drastic of these changes is Santana, who is of course named after Carlos Santana. His name is completely overhauled to San Fiento. In the case of Santana, the translators couldn't have used their trusty phonetically spell out the character's Japanese name in English trick they used with the other three because it would have been spelled the same exact way. That could very much explain why his name change was so extravagant. Next we have Loggins named after Kenny Loggins being renamed to Logs. And the last part two name change we have is Donovan being renamed to Donna Bang. Or is it Don Dono Bang? I don't know. I, think I'll have to I haven't watched the English dub so I'm not sure so someone tell me in the comments. Yari yari daze. It's time for Jojo Part 3, Stardust Crusaders. I mentioned Diva the Curse earlier, and he is completely renamed to Soul Sacrifice, dodging the Diva reference entirely, and referencing instead the 1969 Santana album, Soul Sacrifice. Hooray! The dub got a Santana reference after all! Captain Tennille is renamed to Captain Dragon in the English dub. A possible Step Brothers reference? Cause boats and hoes? IDK. One of my absolute favorite changes in Stardust Crusaders is for the man with two right arms, the assassin, Jay Guile. In the dub, he is known as Centerfold, a reference to the 1981 song by the Jay Guile's band. You know, the really catchy song, na 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 After you watch the Jay Guile's arc in part 3, do yourself a favor and read through the comments on the Centerfold YouTube video. They're hilarious. 
Jay Giles' mother, Enya the Hag, named after the singer Enya, who's not a hag, has her name ever so slightly changed from Enya to Enya Ba. In the Japanese version, her last name is Guile, so would that make her English version Enya Ba Fold or Centerfold? I don't know, is his first name Center and his last name Fold? Well, better move on. Stilly Dan was changed to Dan of Steel. Midler was renamed to Rose. Daniel J. Darby and Tellens T. Darby lose their first name and middle initial in the localized version and are simply called Darby Elder and Darby Younger, respectively. Moving on to the next brother duo, Oingo and Boingo, both of them get their names changed completely to Zenyatta and Mondata, based off the 1980 Cars album of the same name. Although you can still see Oingo Boingo written on Boingo's stand. That's kind of funny. Kenny G, named after Kenny G, is renamed to Billy Jean based off the MJ song, Billy Jean. Dio's right-hand man, Vanilla Ice, a stealth striker from the shadows, has his name appropriately changed to Go Ninja, Go Ninja Go in the US dub. A reference, of course, to the Vanilla Ice song from the Ninja... Uh, <laughs> just kidding. He's actually renamed to the less cool, Cool Ice. But how cool would it have been if they called him Go Ninja, Go Ninja Go? Missed opportunity, if you ask me. Oh, or since his stand's name is Cream, they could have called him Chocolate Ice and Cream. Pet Shop, named after the Pet Shop Boys, is renamed to, get this, Animal Shop in the Eyes of Heaven game. And lastly for Stardust Crusaders, we have Wilson Phillips, who is just referred to as Senator Phillips. Now onto JoJo Part 4, Diamond is Unbreakable. Or as the cool kids call it, Diamond is not Crash. The main JoJo part for Josuke Higashikata's stand Crazy Diamond, a reference to the Pink Floyd song Shine On You Crazy Diamond, is renamed to Shining Diamond. Ah, very clever. They did a great job of keeping the spirit of the original name while avoiding legal shenanigans. Now, is it safe to assume that since Crazy Diamond is Shining Diamond in the States, he is more sane than his Japanese counterpart? I'll let you decide. Koichi's stand Echoes, also named after a Pink Floyd song, is changed to Reverb. Surface is changed to Show Off. Yukiko's stand Love Deluxe is changed to Love Extra, but only for the Eyes of Heaven game. Bad Company is changed to, oh boy, Worst Company. The yellow colored capital looking stand Red Hot Chili Pepper is apparently neither red nor hot in the US version, so they simply refer to it as Chili Pepper. Pearl Jam is Pole Jam in the English dub, and Opal Jam in the All-Star Battle Game. I like Opal Jam better. The Might Be an Alien Guy, Mikitaka Hazakura stand, named Earth, Wind, and Fire, is changed to Terra Ventus. Is that a mother Kingdom Hearts reference? In all seriousness, Terra means Earth and Ventus means Wind in Latin. But where's the fire? Or should I say, where's the Ignis? Yuya Fugami stand Highway Star is changed to Highway Go Go. Stray Cat is changed to Feral Cat. Superfly has the most world breaking change so far. The localizers were so bold, they actually went so far as to delete the space between the two words, turning Superfly into Superfly. Checkmate, Curtis Mayfield. You ain't getting a dime from Diamond Is Not Crash. Next up, we have the guaranteed to blow your mind anytime stand, Killer Queen, who is renamed to the less thrilling. Ugh. Deadly Queen. Oh, it hurts me to say that. Killer Queen's second bomb, Sheer Heart Attack, is changed to Heart Attack, and Bites the Dust is changed to Bite the Dust. No S. They couldn't even shell out for that extra S. Even the 4Kids dub of Yu-Gi-Oh! was bold enough to say the actual name of the song. Another one bites the dust! So there you have it, all the name changes in JoJo Part 1 through 4. If this video gets enough likes and shares, I'll definitely cover all the name changes in Part 5 through 8. And I so want to talk about D4Cs and Notorious B.I.G. and Spice Girls U.S. names. But that'll have to wait for now. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more content. Ding that bell to make sure you never miss a vid. Also, if you'd like to see more JoJo videos on this channel, let me know. I actually have a few topics in mind, and me and Black Bear Kid were working on a review for Part 1. So, uh, yeah, if you guys are interested in it, we're definitely going to make it for you.